today we're going to be discussing the different views available in computer and how to change among the views and how to sort in the different views. Now the view that we're in right now is the small icon view. This view is good if you have a lot of things in a given folder that you'd like to be able to see all at once, if you have very good eyesight and good hand-eye coordination. You might decide, however, you'd like to see things a little bit larger. If you right-click at a blank part of the screen in the pane, you can choose View, and instead of choosing small icons, I might choose medium or large or even extra large icons. In all of these views, you see an icon representing the object as well as the object's name. Once I get into the large icon view, I can actually see a thumbnail of one of the uh, pictures in here. There's another way you can change among views, but you need to be able to see your menu bar to do that. You might not see your menu bar, and if it's hidden, you can display it by going to Organize, Layout, and click on Menu Bar. From here, you have a menu option, and you have the same views available here that you had by right-clicking. You can go through each of the views yourself and see what's available. The one other view that I'd really like to point out, however, is the Details view. I really like this view because it gives you not just the information you had before in the small and the large icons view, but it gives you some additional information as well. When was the file last uh, modified? What type of file is it? What's its size? And if you right-click on the field headings row, you could choose to add even additional fields to display. By default, your files are probably going to be organized alphabetically A to Z, first A through to Z in the folders, then A to Z in the file names. If you wish to change the order when you're in the detailed view, it's really easy. Maybe I'd like to group all of my bitmap images together. I'd like to create a folder and put all of my bitmap images in. Well, I can just click on the field heading for type, and if I click on it once, everything will be sorted in ascending order by type, folders first, then file. If I click on a type field heading again, it re reverses the sort order, so it's sorting in descending order. I'm going to go back to having things sorted alphabetically by name. This method of sorting is only available in the detailed view. If I switch to one of the other views, uh, maybe the medium icons view, I can still sort, but to do so, I would right-click on a blank part of the pane and then choose Sort By and select the field I'd like to sort by. Again, maybe date modified. Maybe I'd like to have all the things that were modified fairly recently close together so I can see. I, n I remember that I wanted to work with a Word document that I worked with just last week, but I don't remember what the name of the document was. By sorting according to um, last modified, I'd be able to see fairly quickly which document was modified in the past week. The sort order and the view that you use does not change the contents of the folder. Neither one changes the contents of the folder. You may use any sort order, any view that you find useful. Um, Sometimes you might want to change back and forth between the views. That is entirely your choice. One of the advantage, advantages of modern operating systems is that you do have the customization. So go and choose whatever you'd like to do.